this. Okay. Good for a Thank present you. or gift. Only three dollars. Is it good? Do you think it's good? <laughs> good for person? Yeah. <laughs> yes. Alright. So I'll get how many? One, two, three, four, five. Can I get twenty? No, I can. Can I get twenty? Yeah. Well, no, get twenty. Twenty? <laughs> okay, get twenty. Hey guys how are you doing today so in today's video guys because it's raining outside and I cannot do anything outside the garden so I decided to make a DIY project so I have these uh, ceramic pots here this is not a glass it's a ceramic one but there is no hole so we will do a repotting as well as I would like to enhance enhance this uh, pot a little bit give a little bit of color but i'm not going to paint it so stick around guys and join me and see what will be the outcome of this project so what i'm going to use is i'm going to use some string like this colorful string and i'll just wrap around on the top opening of the jar just wrap around just to add some color in our pot i think yellow is nice you just wrap it around you can make a sticker as you want i think that will do that's nice simple but beautiful that's all really what i'm going to do that's it i like that color but if you want more pots designs, check out Crafts and Succulents channel. She got a lot of beautiful and easy pots DIY designs that you can do it yourself. So guys, please don't forget to check it out, Crafts and Succulent YouTube channel. So, how about that? Pretty, see? So guys, now we already uh, put a color on our pot. Now it's time to choose our plant. So I decided to have this agave here. So I choose the agave for this yellow pot here. It matches the yellow color in here. So that will be good with that. And now I choose this peperomia here to match the color of green here. So this green, the leaf, not the underneath, just on top of it, will match the color of that pot, isn't it? Gorgeous, gorgeous. All right. Then the next one over here, this one here, just the same brown. Oh, look at this. How about that one, guys? Perfect, isn't it? And then the other one, I'll put, although it's not the same color, but I will put down his uh, sedum burritos here because I would like to put sedum burritos in this part as well. So let's do that guys and see how it is going to turn out. Now we just have to brush that off just to remove those dirt. So this one guys is a perfect project for you on the weekend. So this can be a beautiful birthday present as well. Easy to make and if you are in a rush and you don't know what to do, then if you have lots of succulent or plants, then 
perfect for that. Just spice up a little bit your pots and you're good to go. Very good guys. Pretty, isn't it? Beautiful, look at that. Colon Kori Tementosa. Pretty color. Look at those brown tips in there, like um, copper tone. So no, beautiful. Then dark brown here, then copper tone here. So pretty. All right, let's put some soil. How cool is that? It's pretty beautiful. Perfect. So with this one here guys, the last one, because we're using a stem cuttings and it's a fresh cut, you have to use a dry soil or at least a slightly moist soil. Just remove these leaves in here on the top, at least an inch. Okay. Now don't show your leaf. Because that leaf is still going to grow. Beautiful one. There you go, guys. Pretty, pretty, pretty. Now, here you go. What about that for a present to your friend or maybe to yourself? Isn't it? It's beautiful. So, if you cannot give it to your friend as a present, well, keep it to yourself, isn't it? Well, I will keep it to myself, I think. It's so beautiful. So that's it for today guys, please don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell so every time we have a new video like this, you will be notified and you will not miss a thing. And please don't forget to give our video a thumbs up as well and I will see you in the comment box and see you next time. Bye!